There's two things that everybody loves. Booze and bacon. So let's put them together. This Ricky guy has been requesting a Bloody Mary bacon jerky. I guess we might as well continue this bacon trend we got going on. I think a good, bold Bloody Mary flavor would pair really well with the bacon. Plus, I know you guys like the booze. Do you know how I know this? Because they're starting to recognize me at the nearest liquor store. And I don't even drink. Oh yeah, this is that part where I almost forgot the celery salt. Anyway, mix all that stuff together, cover it up, throw it in the fridge, and then the next day pull it all out and rack it up. You're on the home stretch now. Just throw it in. You're trusting dehydrator, set your time and temperature for your desired texture, and then just wait it out. Because shortly you'll have Bloody Mary Bacon Jerky. I'm not going to lie, I have pretty high hopes, but we'll see what the taste testers think when they give us a full review in a part two tomorrow.